Welcome to It's a Lifestyle. In today's video, I'm gonna show you part two of the home renovation in the master bathroom. Um, it was only supposed to take a week. Just to recap, it's been five. I'm showing you week three and week four because a lot of times during those weeks, there was only one person here doing the work. And the job that we wanted done again was the master bath, the guest bathroom, and my backsplash, which you can see right here that it's finished, this part. So, oh, praise God, hallelujah, that it's done. But now, let me just take you along on this bit short little video of week two and week three. Yeah, not week, no, week three and week four. If you haven't seen part, um, one which is week one and week two of the renovation go and check that video out again it's a little short and sweet one just giving you an introduction to the renovation so i hope you enjoy to all my subscribers i hope you enjoy this part two again leave a comment below i really appreciate all of your new ideas that you might have for me and thanks for hanging in there with me until the next video god bless bye It's renovation part three. This is week three and four combined. This is the floor that we ended up going with. It's a tile that looks like wood. We did um, as close as we could to no grout, but we picked a gray grout seam. They laid the tile inside the shower which is that geometric design I showed you in that renovation hall what I picked and these actually were from Lowe's as well and that's marble so let me just go show you it's a hot mess from the contractors but that's the shower going from wall to wall We went with a Corian. It just was uh, more on the cheaper side than marble in the whole shower. I had them built those soap, you know, where you put your shampoo holes on each side. Each side. So it's giving you the marble fill, but half of the cost. Corian is also very durable, stain resistant, and for us who dye their hair, you know, you're not gonna have to worry about it staining. And then we went with a little, installing a little bench right there. Um, they put the vanity in. They're getting ready to, you know, continue to paint everything. They moved over all the light switches, lifted the, um, they lifted the light fixture, which I have a big mirror that's gonna go there, and they installed this mirror that I got at a consignment housing store. This medicine cabinet is well over like a hundred bucks and I got it for ten dollars. So long, it's so nice. Love it. And the commode. <laughs> we went um, with the large tr 
trim, still pulling the um, floor throughout. That's the new toilet from Costco. It's the same exact toilet that we got in the guest bathroom. Yep, so as you can see, this was the large molding baseboards that we got. It makes the room look so much more taller and bigger. Well, that's renovation week three and four. Like I said, this was supposed to only be a week. It's just too long. Still got lots to do. Master bath. Welcome to It's a Lifestyle, my mom's channel. As you may know, we're on t part two of the house renovation. And as you may know, the black splash of our kitchen is ready. And my bathroom's done. It just needs a mirror. But my mom and dad's bathroom need, uh, needs the mirror and the door to the shower. And I hope you guys are tuned in with my mom to know what's going on, so yeah.